Back into position. He's got priority again. Lining up another one here, looking at backdoor. This is a big wave. He's locked in. He should come through this one. Come here on. he comes. Oh my Medina, God. the hands go up, and for good reason. You're kidding. One of the biggest Coming waves this that we've seen. This wave is red. And here we go. This is red. Gabriel Medina. Knifing into a pipeline. Barrel still going and comes out. And then tucks into another barrel. So Medina. Trying for the two for one special. You know, once that sun gets high, have a look at Medina. Medina now to... locking in off the bottom, pulls in nice and deep. The wave spits him out. But here we go, something standing up on the outside. Medina's committing. Grabs that rail to begin with. Gets a hold of it again to find the exit. And a bit going on as he rode out of that barrel. Medina, a slow start, but getting busy now, just slides his way into this one. Rolling through it, a bit of foam on the face. No dramas for Medina. He dropped it at 8.9 on his first wave. He's backed it up. Well you know, here. Owen Wright, he wants every wave he sees. Every wave he sees. Look at this one. Gabriel Medina on a beauty, beautiful insult. Oh my goodness, that was just absolutely beautiful to watch. He caught the rail as he came into that thing, but then came flying out. For that incredible wave, as we see that familiar face, John John Florence looking on. Oh. Paying attention to this. Medina <laughs> spat out of another pipe bomb. Starting to all fire up right now. Look at that beautiful takeoff straight into the barrel from Gabriel Medina up and over the foam ball. Critical stuff. Have a, have a look at this one, Joe. He is literally under the hood on the takeoff. And you heard Sebastian Ziz talk about steep and deep. That's what you've got to do here at Pipeline. You've got to take off late. Whether to position for the waves or to position considering your opponents. Here goes Gabriel going the back door. Beautiful looking wave. Gabe tucks in, drags that body and gets Woo! that out. And he loves that feeling. Amazing stuff. Took it next level as usual. Well, having a look at this one, is Gabriel Medina locked in so deep. Can he find his way through? You know he can. <laughs> and it was just a given. And now a huge alley-oop. He's not going to stick it, but unbelievable to start from Medina, the, the wave of the morning. Man. Last year, we, we thought Juwanderu was going to be safe. He, he was lucky to, to hold on to the 22nd spot. As we see, Medina tucking in again. And he is going to fly out. We talk about uh, surfers feeling the mana. Mecca and Medina's feeling it today. That was... Well, it's all about this bottom turn. Watch him drag right there. He, he really delayed as long as he could. He didn't have the option of dragging down the face. He had the bottom turn, which is not ideal for these guys. But he made up for it with a cheeky kind of tail block stall. Watch his tail right here. He just kind of right there. That lip barely missed his head. He did all he could to slow down enough. The air is just a little icing on the cake. 100%. And, uh, you know, that's not a, a claim that's looking to milk some extra points out of the judges. He knew he was up against it. And he has delivered in a big way, something he's so capable of doing. When the heat is on, no one steps up like Medina. That is going to be a monster number. Watch the tail block. I mean, it really is all about this stall. That's what separates this guy from almost everyone on tour. Right here, he's going to stomp on his tail to get that stall. Right there. And now he's wiping off speed. That equates to longer time in a barrel. That equates to commitment. The judges are going to notice that. And that's going to, you know, he's going to milk every decimal out of this uh, big score. The numbers coming through for Medina. Have a look at the height there on that huge air. He's just dropped a 9.43. So absolutely slicing up the requirement. Only needs a 4.83 now to get himself into the lead here. And that might be a big one in the context of this heat, but he's got to convert on this next ride. He needs some big numbers. Here he goes on the back end, eyeing off back door. This wave's starting to set up nicely. Drags the body for a moment, locks in the wave spits. He's still gunning. And Medina will come out with the second spit here at backdoor. <laughs> so there you go, big turning point. Selling a wave to Geordie Smith, getting priority back and making it count. The sellers are the first to win the Pipe Masters for Brazil. Medina looking to be the second. Here he goes, Medina's first wave of the final, super deep in pipe, and comes out. Unbelievable exit. <laughs> Let's see what happened on the takeoff. Yeah, Gabriel grabs the rail, pulls up, drives through that section, and then comes out nice and clean. 8.28 required, Joe. Nice and deep on the reef as well. And again, just, you know, not just sticking to one line through the barrel, having to readjust all the way through it. Gabriel 
Medina comes out. Is that going to be an 8.28? Is that? Well, it's uh, he, he looks solid. I mean, it, it, you know, this is a battle. We're going to see this go down. Here we go. Gabriel on another one. Big B hook. Just blowing through the barrel. It's amazing out here. Are you kidding me? And Medina trying to punch free from that inside oh. wall. Somehow hangs on. Nothing can take this man down. Time and time again, he comes here to Pipeline to show that he is the most radical surfer in the world. Porter finally out as a rookie when everyone was doubting him. As we keep tabs with the requalification race. Here at the final stop of the season, Gabriel Medina defending Pipe Master in a cave. Comes out behind the spit. Medina with a big number coming his way. He sees where it's at. He knows exactly to when to go right, when to go left. And it looks like he's looking at this one right now. He was way deep on this thing. That's a deep tube ride right there. Almost. <laughs> wow. He makes it. That was oh, incredible. Man. Into a big power hack off the lip from Gabriel Medina. Just getting started for the wild card. Kelly trying to fight for the lead. Here comes Gabriel Medina driving hard. It's waiting for him. Big wind up. Front side punt complete. <laughs> wow. But he is up against the most consistent performer here at Pipeline over the last six years. Gabriel Medina's just made his home out here. Won the event last year, a world title year, and he is looking just as comfortable once again. Often says he doesn't touch that rail because he feels more comfortable, more mobile, standing tall. Medina in position, though. Here he goes, swinging. Nice casual bottom turn, great section. Wave spits him out. Gabriel setting up a huge front side air oh. and just slides away from a massive front side air attempt. John made that wave at back door, 483. Here goes Medina, solid section, wide open. Oh, wow. Gabriel off the lip, a front side punt on one of the best. Executed combinations of the day. One could pop up at any time. This wave looks pretty decent. Medina, well positioned, drops into it, hugs the wall of that wave, should find his way through. The wave spits, out he comes. And that will replace the 3.67 he had in his score line. There was this almost repetitious fire that he would get at the J Bay mark, where he would all of a sudden explode and then basically take over the back end of the year. Let's see what happens here. Medina in motion. Great read, wild takeoff, and it's opening up for Gabriel to get his best wave of the matchup. Right when we were talking about firing and needing a big score, Medina right on cue. It's still the, the best trophy and the most respected trophy. I think so. It's to see that uh, these guys are still doing this out there for, a, for the best trophy, I think, in surfing. What almost looks like a sure make once he sets his rail. He ended up going down. Here's Medina to try to make him pay for that one. Gets spit out, kicks out quickly to fight for priority. All completions in Medina's favor. Yeah. As we take another look at Gabe here. All right, back. look at that. Look how deep he is backside. I mean, I don't even think he grabbed his rail on that, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Throwing kisses to the panel, to the crowd.